How's it going, everyone? Welcome back to Flames Plays, and today we're continuing in Frambo, where we are... Uh, we need to... Oh, God, we actually need to cut ourselves. Yeah. Because that's the blood we need for the executor of the thing. Wow, it's just a little tiny... It's just like streams of blood. Sometimes things just don't work. Uh, do I need to put it in here? Use Fran's blood with the boiling water. There goes my blood. I hope it tastes good. Tra la la. It's okay. Uh, we're going to put the rose in there. So, let's see. What else do we need? Uh, we did that. We did that. Oh, we need salt and pepper. Uh, 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 uh. Salt and pepper here. I'm gonna push it real good. Um, there's just one more thing we need the hair. We need the hair from them. Where would we find the hair at? It could be... Like, do they have a comb or something in their bedroom? I want to steal it from? That's a good thought. Co oh, pillow. Oh, probably from the bed. I'll lay down and sleep tight when I get back home. Nope, never mind. That's not the thing I want. Nice stuff. I'm basically just clicking around like a crazy person. Trying to figure this out. All right, guess we're gonna go ahead and just do this. What is that sound? I already hate it. Um, let's see. That's missing a head, that's right. Oh, a typewriter. I guess I could write, but there's no paper. Oh, wait, can I use the paper here? Yes, I can. All right, I see where this is going. Hair from your head. It's literally just it's a completely different wrong font and type, type font, that's a size font. Everything's wrong in that, but okay. Come on, let's do this. Oh, hello, hi, I forgot that. Friend, here are the materials you need, you'll need. Have you studied the ritual? Yes, but I need more time. I can't remember all the words. Well, learn them fast. Let us know when you're ready. I don't like how their heads sway so much when they walk, but I mean, I guess. Oh God, Fraga, Psst, girl, I think you need help getting rid of this bag. This bag, I could do that for you, but I may need it. No, you don't. Trust me. If we want to get out of here, this bag must disappear. I'll take it. You didn't see me. Bye. <laughs> I love the idea of a frog just basically stealing from two humans. Uh, all right. So we need our hair. So we just show them this horribly doctored thing. Uh, look, ladies, there's something missing. I couldn't find your hair in the bag. Hair, you say? There's no hair needed. We know that. Mm, look for, But look for yourself. It's written down there in the recipe. That's true. How could we miss that? All right. There. Now get prepared. Sweet. Take that, you dumb conjoined twins. I'm not saying they're dumb because they're conjoined twins. I'm saying they're just dumb because they didn't read the, the thing at all. All right. So we're going to pop this into here. And we're going to, now the hair, good. Uh, is it done? Oh, okay. That was weird. I should show the girls the potion's ready. Okay. Uh, all right. Let's go ahead and give them this delectable looking soup of hair and flowers. Everything's ready. Let's go to the kitchen. Good, let's go. Oh, they're gonna fall for it. Be great. Yeah. Yep, yep, yep. Go ahead. Yeah, you're in the pentagram. Neat. Please sit down and close your eyes, lady. Alright. So we're gonna do this. Uh use potion with twins. We just okay, we just dump it on their face, I guess. It's probably still scalding hot. Oh right, I forgot to click. And now I'll say the words. Bante er erken o ir bag bag o ibir nam ibir ig banter er ikem begma hafma man dam gonfma ibir equitus ername bomeg ibirum isni. I'm pretty sure I just cursed out like a lot of things. Wait a second, that is not the right spell. You tricked us. Oh, uh oh. I don't think it was the right spell for me either. Maybe. Oh. Okay. 
Yeah, so the Phyrexians are back, apparently. Neat. What have I done? Oh my goodness, this is not right. But I got a key. The key. Now I can free my dear kitty. I'm nervous. Why did I add... Why did I give Fran a British accent now? I, I gotta get my characters in check. Mm -hmm. That's that's the biggest thing about trying to do like voices for this game, or for any game, is making sure you remember the characters' uh, voices each time. There you go. So we got the key. I'm gonna use it on the golden cage. What is it, Fran? Open the cage. I can't. Uh, I can't. The key doesn't fit. Did you see another keyhole somewhere? I, I, I don't know. I have to look around. I'll be waiting. Hurry up. Okay. I don't remember another keyhole anywhere around here. Oh. Oh. A little keyhole. I wonder. Okay. All right. I see. Let's go ahead and pop that up. What the heck is this? Oh, God. Oh, it's a puzzle. Well, if it isn't that just swell. How close does that have to be? What am I trying to do? I know what I'm... Okay, I know... I get what I'm trying to do. I need to move the gears so that this one can't be moved. Alright. So I need to... It looks like I need to move the two gears close to each other. It's the only thing I can think of. The question is, where does that go then? Oh, I have to move them over that way. Whoopsie doodles. So this one should go here. Maybe? I don't... I... Where does this go then? It's not actively doing anything different here. I guess I have to open this thing, but... How? Can I just turn this by hand? Maybe? I feel like that one should be fine. Unless... Oh, so maybe... Maybe the big gear has to be over there? Alright. This is... I'm going to be honest, this is going to take me a long time, so I'm just going to skip ahead. You guys don't want to see me suffer through this thing. Oh. Oh. I'm very glad I solved that puzzle, apparently. Oh. What is this? Two skeletons? They're kind of small, like me. I can imagine who these people were. Then I'm not a killer. Okay, so yeah, we, we're not a killer, they... Oh. Sister Promise. We, Clara and Mia Belhamut, promise to revenge the unfair destiny Iltward, Itward, decided for us. That's, that name showed up again. With blood and tears, we promise that we will kill him and bring our bodies back. We won't stand this any longer. Even though we are sisters, we hate each other and will always hate each other. Nothing will ever change that. But now with our bodies attached to each other, we can't complete our task. The strongest will live forever and the weakest will die. Du Duotine. My pillows are called Duotine too, so she was making those. She was taking, they were taking those as well. We got the key. Mother must die. Ew. Maybe that mommy wasn't a good mommy at all. My mommy was very good. She hugged me many times. She had a doll. It must be a really old doll. A bow. Okay, so nothing else I can really pick up. Just the sisters have a huge scar in the middle. That's scary. Maybe there are two different persons after all. The bed and floor looks so familiar. So they were patients at the asylum, it looks like. We have the key. So we can go rescue our kitty. Or we have a key. It might not be the right key. This is the fox head. Foxy don't know what's problem for Foxy Fox. Hope someday I find a fox that isn't dead so I can talk to it. All right, we have this key that we can use on the golden cage. I think this is the key. It worked, my dear kitty. It worked. Come out. Let me hug you. Oh. Oh. Reunited and it feels so good. Oh, it's so cute. See a little tears of joy? That cat's so happy. Right? I forgot I had to click. Oh, this feels so good. I'm free, friend, my old my good friend. You are free, my dear. Now it's time to go home. Yes, let's go. Alright, Mr. Kitty, you just follow me. We're gonna find our way to uh Aunt Grace's. How do we get out of here now? That's a good question. Okay. 
Let's go through here. Go this way. I did it, Sir Toad. The girls are gone. That is perfect. Now I can leave this place and go to my family. I want to do that too, sir. I finally found my kitty. I just want to go home now and be with Aunt Grace. But how you will get out of here? There is no boat. I can't swim and Mr. Midnight is so afraid of water. I would love to help you, but I'm too tiny. Even though my body is quite moldable, it will be impossible to carry you both to their side. Let me think about it. Don't leave us yet, please. Uh, okay, so the bike doesn't really do anything. Uh, oh, the, the broom? What if I give him the broom? I can't do that, no. Oh, I clicked out. There you go. Alright, let me try to think now. We have a broom, we have a knife. Uh, nope. Can't, can't, can't stab him. Oh, the kid, Mr. Midnight fell asleep. It was so cute. Uh, right. Mr. Midnight, we need to get home, kitty. I hope that way back home isn't far away. Uh, I hope so too, friend. We can do this together. I can help you. What about this, actually? The bed. I won't lay down on that thing. Oh, I was thinking I could, like, hop on board it or something. Uh, let's see. What do I have? So it's definitely the frog that's gonna let me go. Can I give him the crayon? No. He doesn't care about that. What about baking soda? Take this, Toad. It may help. I'm not a bakery bun. But you are all slimy and soft like dough. You're right. It may work. Here goes. Oh. It worked. It really did. I'm so big and I feel gorgeous. Great. Let's go. Come, Mr. Midnight. Sure, Fran, I only have one complaint. That giant toad is staring at me. What are you talking about? He wants to help us, that's all. Alright, if he tries anything, I will scratch him. That's okay, but try not to hurt him so much while we're sitting on him. The water is deep, and we don't know what kind of creatures are in there. If we fall in the water, we could die, kitty. Oh, I promise I won't scratch the toad. Let's go. Hey, girl, before I go, I forgot to give you something. I saw you in this picture, so I thought it was yours. Oh, he got a picture from the sewers. And this book is with it, too. Leon. Oh, Toad, you found my family photo. Thank you very much. I thought I had lost it forever, but the book is not mine. Oh, well, take the book as a gift. It's always healthy to read. It has many pictures. Wow, thank you. I like pictures. Well, let's go now. Yes, here we go. Hold on tight. <laughs> Onward. <laughs> Love the little finger point. Mr. Midnight's at the top, just like, <gasps> and Fran's all scared. So cute. What's what am I doing? Oh my god, I'm playing Frogger. Nope, that, that was a bad start. Okay, so I'm just basically straight up playing Frogger right now. Um, how, there's not like enough time though. There you go. Um, Please, please, please thingy. There you go. Good. Okay. This is so cute. And it's all claymation, too. I wasn't expecting this. Like, at all. I wasn't expecting a, a Frogger minigame. And I certainly wasn't expecting it to be claymation. It's so adorable. Alright. We gotta wait for something to come a little closer. There you go. We're gonna hop on this leaf and then do a quick double jump. Bam. Now that here's a Frogger experience. Actually, to be honest, I haven't played Frogger that much. It's not one of those retro games I really enjoy, like that, all that, all that. Galaga is probably my favorite retro game. Uh, and then probably Asteroids, maybe after that one. Here we are. Jump off me now. Let's go, kitty. I really thought this game was gonna end with me leaving the asylum. I didn't think it would go this long. Wow. Well, now it's time to go home. I hope you find your family soon, Sir Toad. Thank you. You too. Farewell. Goodbye, sir, and thanks for the thank you for the ride. Uh, Fran, well, what should we do now? Find the way back home, Kitty. Do you see the sky? It's dawn, and really soon all the scary things will disappear. Ah, uh, I'm so hungry and sleepy. I want to go home now. Me too, Kitty. We'll find the way. I'll do my best to help you, my dear. Let's go. Oh, here, let's take it. Let's pop a pill. Dead, dead toad? Oh. Oh dear, baby skeleton. I guess they didn't make it in time. Good night and sweet dreams. Alright, so not much in here. Just the, 
poor, our poor kitty just like phases in and out. Let me take the pill. What's over here? Oh, you guys got stuck again. Sir, are you the curious insects that get stuck? They are sleeping. Maybe they're not stuck. I hope they find they have their hair comb. Alright, so not much in there. Oh dear, this bridge looks pretty Oh dear, oh dear, this bridge looks pretty scary. Oh Fred, come on. We have to go home. There's no time to be afraid now. Yes, but I'm a bit afraid of heights. Um, I can go first, alright? Then you follow me. Alright, kitty. You're so sweet. I'll be right behind you. There he goes with this old 12 pound weight. All right, now let's let's do our 10 year old weight. Yep, this is we're gonna fall. We're totally gonna fall. Wait for it. Just gonna wait for it. Uh, Mr. Min Mr. Midnight, Fran, wait. Oh, oh no, you. Get him, get him, Mr. Midnight. Oh, never mind. No, oh, we both fell. Really? Oh no, oh no. Oh, yeah, okay, he's fine, he's there. Oh my dear, I can't hold it anymore. I don't want to die. You won't die, my friend. Come on, you can do it. Jump. Alright, here we go. Oh, I got you. Oh, you're a, you're a cat. <laughs> what the <laughs> hell? I don't know why I thought that was going to work for a second, too. It's like, here, take my paw. It, it, you don't have a posable thumb. You can't get a good grip. Friend, no. Oh my god. <laughs> All right, Mr. Midnight doing a belly flop is just like my favorite thing right now. Don't be afraid, Fran. We always fall. And after the pain, we will always rise. <gasps> Who's that? Who's that helping out that? Grace. Aunt Grace? A dear Aunt Grace, don't, oh, oh dear Aunt Grace, don't ever leave me. Don't cry, my little girl. Your heart is pure, but your mind is tormented. You have to stay and walk your own path. Please, Aunt Grace, why won't you just take me out of here? Please. You'll just leave me all alone, like my mother and father did. I'm sorry, my dear friend. You will soon understand. Aunt Grace, no, please don't. Don't go, please, please. <sighs> Dr. Jern. Friend, it's time for your new medicine. Okay. She was attacked by red vines, and not the yummy licorice ones. Are you playing as Mr. Midnight now? Or why are Fran's clothes all strewn across here? That's weird. Oh, I am playing. Oh, what happened? Where am I? Fran, where are you? Oh, I'm collecting Fran's clothes. These are Fran's stockings. One of Fran's shoes. Another of Fran's shoes. Fran's shoe. She's not there. Okay. I don't have pills and I don't have an inventory. Oh, why does this tree have a face? Actually, it's a good question. Oh, what an ugly tree. I scratched you, evil thing. Kitty, kitty, stop it. What are you talking about? Fran, my darling, is that you? It can't be. What is it, my dear? Of course it's me. Who else would I be? Fran? You are a tree. Don't be silly. Help me get up. Wait, just a second. Where are my hands? Why can't I move? I'm telling you, my dear. You've become a tree. What? But how? Oh, my dear. This was the end of a line. The big monster did this. I know it, Kitty. He won't let us go home. I hope he won't come back. He was very scary. He always comes back. I think I remember him from that night. That night, Mom and Dad died. Kitty, I don't want to talk about it. I just want to go home. You are a tree, my friend. A tree. I can't carry you all the way back home. Besides, I'm not sure where we are, either. Am I going to die, Kitty? Tell me. Please don't say that, friend. Don't leave me. But I feel so weak. Honka. Ignima. 
Igni mi hola. Kolke, koke igrama. Paska hola ni. Igni jokol. Vanti. I'm sorry, what is going on here? Ah, be careful, sir. Why are you attacking me? Would you please tell me where I am, sir? Kolka, kolke hola. Stop it, I'll scratch you. Hola, Roma igni. What are they saying? Oh my dear, oh my kitty, what is, why is this happening to us? Hola. Stop attacking me, please. I mean no harm. Hola ig ni vanti. Kitty, help me find my purse, please. Maybe I can do something about this. I'll see what I can do, Fran. Cool, so they're just... Stop attacking my friend, Carrot. Can't really understand what you're saying. Okay. So, this is just... What has happened to this game? I'm going to keep looking. I'll keep looking for my friend. I don't know what's going on at this point now. <laughs> we just got turned into a tree. But I want to wrap this episode up here. I hope you all are joining the series. And if you are, let me know in the comments down below. Give me a thumbs up. I really do appreciate that. And also make sure you're subscribed. So you have this release new content when I or go live while live streaming. And as always, have a great day. Remember to burn bright. I'll talk to you all later. Bye.